one of the sessions in the afternoon. Let's just uh, start on that particular note where various dignitaries are gathered in Eldoret, Wasingishu County to deliberate on martyrs' devolution and to take stock of the hits and misses made after a decade of devolved leadership. Let's cross over live and take a look at some of the developments that are happening at this hour. Environment and natural resources. Dr. Chris Kipto, the Principal Secretary in the National Treasury, Ms. Amanda Robertson, WASH Team Lead at USAID Kenya, Dr. Sam Karidi, the Country Director at Gadsby Kenya, uh, Cindy Kobe, the communi 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 Community Advocacy and Awareness uh, Cron Trust, and Dr. Philip Kisoyan, who's the Lead Natural Resource Governance. This will be the Water, Forestry, and Natural Resources Management Breakaway the youth breakaway session will be the other breakaway session this afternoon will the theme will be empowering youth for inclusive economic growth the role of the bottom-up economic transformation agenda in kenya to be moderated by Ms. Wenjohi joroge and the keynote speaker will be mr david bagenda who is a country director mastercard foundation kenya the session will be chaired by governor simon kachapin Chairperson of the COG Gender, Youth, Culture, Sports, and Social Services Committee. Among the speakers and the panelists in this session will be Governor Stephen Sang, the Governor of Nandi County, the Honorable Ababu Namwamba, the CS Ministry of Youth, the Arts and Sports, Engineer Stephen Ogenga, who is the CEO of National Industrial Training Authority, Ms. Edna Carijo, Digital Skills Program Manager at Immobilis. Abel Mutua, who is a zero, zero malaria starts with me, ambassador and filmmaker, and Mohammed Gold. Pictures Gold Gold from Gold Gold Eldoret in Wasin Gishu County, Center. all to do with the devolution conference as we mark 10 years of devolution since it was incepted in 2013. We'll definitely keep you updated about the development set to happen in the afternoon, as I informed you. Former Prime Minister Rilo Dinga.